Evening, could new EPA rules seriously harm Southwest Louisiana's economy? Senator David Vitter and other politicians say yes, and they came to Lake Charles today to explain why. KPLC's Erica Ferrando joins us now with more. Cynthia, the issue is ozone, ground level ozone to be exact, which is linked to respiratory problems. The EPA is expected to announce tough new rules for it later this year, something Louisiana lawmakers say could have a devastating impact on industry. The Lake Charles area is about to enter the finest growth period in history. In the next few years, Lake Charles is expected to produce thousands of new jobs with the industrial expansion in the area. Southwest Louisiana is leading the way right now in generating economic growth, job creation, not only for Louisiana, but for the country. It's an, it's an amazing thing. The expected proposal by the Environmental Protection Agency would significantly lower industrial ozone emission levels. I'm real concerned that this new standard would be little to no environmental gain, big, big economic loss, big negative job impact. Could absolutely affect it in a bad way. Here we have industry which has the potential to create great jobs, great benefits for families that are struggling, and EPA comes in with a regulation of unproven value that threatens to squash those jobs. If the new rules are approved, industry leaders say few, if any, Louisiana parishes would meet the new standards and would be designated as noncompliant, which would make it difficult for industry to expand. We would be violating the law under the new standards, so nothing new could happen without a whole lot of other a remediation and other activity that either is impossible to do or very, very expensive to do. It raises the cost significantly for these projects. It could cause some of these companies to rethink their investment. It, um, it certainly will have an Im a direct impact on the job growth uh, in this community.